Well, hello, everybody, and welcome to the second part of the IIWR Spooktacular for 2022. Yeah, as you can see, no one showed up. I should have been touring with Nine Inch Nails right now with my synth goth band, but I don't know. Like, sometimes I just feel like life is meaningless. Huh? What's going on? Someone there? Hello? Whoa. Hey, what's up? How, how did you get here? Well, the door's open. What the hell is this? Oh. You make me feel like I'm not welcome or something. I'm sorry. Introduce yourself. Uh, like, uh, what's your name? The name's T-Bone. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, cool. Um, yeah, it is pretty cool. Well, I was going to play this game. Do you want to uh, be the special guest? Yeah, sure. I ain't got nothing else to do. What I'm going to do, I'll start it, and then I'm going to ask you some questions, and uh, mm. yeah, well, mm -hmm. just t let me do the talking. Okay. Well, hello, everybody. I'm Eric Ravenheart, and welcome to Small Town USA's favorite game show. Fun Fact Check! Yeah! Yes, this is the game show where we test people's ability of knowing what fun facts are. And today's prize is a $5 gift certificate to the Dairy Dip, right here in Small Town, USA. This fun fact check is brought to you by the Dairy Dip. It's time to pack up the monsters and ghouls and head on down to the Dairy Dip. With their $12 chicken strip baskets, 99 cent vanilla cones, and all you can drink soda pop, it's a great pit stop in between all the trick or treating tonight. And only for tonight, pick up the limited edition chocolate cone today. The Dairy Dip, the place for good times and good friends. See, we live in the Midwest where it's very crazy and wild to have chocolate ice cream in a cone. That sucks. Yeah. In this special edition of Fun Fact Check, you have to get 13 questions right in order to win the $5 gift card to the Dairy Dip. Well, game one is called Spot the Fake, where I'm going to read you three fun facts and you have to spot the fake fun fact. Mm. Okay? Okay. All right. So the theme for this set of fun facts is Halloween. Wearing a nun or priest costume for Halloween is illegal in Alabama. In the 1700s, New England settlers saw Halloween as the holiday of the pig. And Halloween is a holiday that is older than 2,000 years old. This one's pretty easy. The second one is the fake fact. Yep, that's right. It's not the holiday of the pig. They never thought of that. You are correct. All right, the next theme for these fun facts is candy. Okay. Before 1952, some Tootsie Rolls used to contain bubble gum. The average trick-or-treat bag will have at least 11,000 calories in its candy. After it's opened, a bag of candy corn can last from three to six months. It has to be that first fun fact. That one's fake. Yep, that's correct. You got another one. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, all right. This third and final set is death. That's Ooh, the thing. my favorite. You're more likely to die from taking a selfie than by a shark attack. Out of all the senses, hearing is the last to go before someone dies. For a short time after death, the human body still continues to grow hair and nails. So I'm going to have to say that second one again. I am sorry, bro, but that is that's Damn it. not right. Oh, come on. I'm sorry. It's actually for a short time after death, the human body still continues to grow hair and nails. That is actually false. Uh, the reason why it looks like that there's that effect is actually the body is shrinking. So it looks like the nails grow longer, but the nails just stay the same. The body is shrinking, which gives the effect that the nails are growing. Whatever. All right, sir, you have two points, and we are now moving on to the multiple choice questions. There's 15 of them to round out 18 questions for this special edition. Fun fact check. Okay, question one. 
The song Monster Mash is from what musical group? A. Bobby Boris Pickett B. Rob Zombie C. The Ghouls Club or D. Nine Inch Nails Uh, It's gotta be number or letter A Yep A. Bobby Boris Pickett Yep In the 1960s Obviously Pretty easy Between the movies Ghostbusters 2 and Ghostbusters Answer the Call from 2016 there were several scripts written during the 20 plus year break which one of these was a potential title for a Ghostbusters 3 movie? A. Back in Action B. Hellbent C. Three in the Box or D. Bill Murray, bro Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Hellbent. That is correct. Ghostbusters 3 was going to be called Hellbent. Yeah, easy. You're throwing me slow pitches here. Come on, bro. Which is not a universal classic movie monster? A. The Wolfman B. Swamp Thing C. Dracula's Daughter or D. The Invisible Man All those movies are boring. I'm gonna have to say C. C. Dracula's Daughter No, you are actually wrong. It was Swamp Thing. Swamp Thing is not a universal classic movie monster. Damn it! Moving on with four points still, Halloween has many other names. Which one of these is not another name for Halloween? A. All Hallows Eve. B. All Saints Eve. C. All Spirits Eve. Or D. Festival of Sam Hain. I'm gonna have to go with uh, letter C. Spirits Eve. That's like a Stardew Valley holiday. That is correct. All Spirits Eve is not another name for Halloween. What is the name for the first horror film? A. Le Manoir du Diable. B. Friday the 13th. C. Nightmare on Elm Street. Or D. Titanic. What was that first one you just said? Oddly Do you know how to read? Are you stupid or something? Bro, just choose one already. Come on. Hey, hey no, on. hey, hey. Who's the guest here? I'm just saying. Don't, don't. I'm trying to do my job here. Yeah, f- fine. Titanic. You're wrong. It's A. Le Manure du Diable. I can't speak French. I don't know. But anyways, if you translate it, the first horror film is known as The Haunted Castle or The House of the Devil, and it was released in 1896. Which state is rock star Marilyn Manson originally from? A. California B. Florida C. New York or D. Ohio The Midwest has the most crazies. Yeah. So I'm going with D. Yep, D, Ohio it is. Yes! So now you have six points, I think. Until 1990, the candy bar Snickers was sold under this name in the United Kingdom. A, the Mars Bar. B, Marathon. C, Peanut Blast. Or D, Chocolate Vein. (laughs) Chocolate Vein. The Marathon Bar. That is correct. B, the Marathon is what the Snickers was called until 1990. What was the year the blue M&M candy was introduced in, with the other colors? A. 1976 B. 2001 C. 1995 or D. 1944 Oh god, the 90s were so good. I miss it so much. The answer is C. Yep, C. 1995. You got it right. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you. All right, you are at seven points. Let's keep going here. Dairy Dip, here I come. The movie Hocus Pocus was originally named what? A, Halloween House. B, Sanderson Sisters Curse. C, Salem's Tale. Or D, The Tale of Thackeray Binks. A, I don't know how people do not know that. Well, I didn't know that. I just stop being like you're so so ooh, I'm so smart, I'm a skull. Oh yeah, I I've been there and came back. Yeah, okay, you're so cool, yeah. You think you're funny, but you're not. I am funny. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. You're not. 
Okay, next question. Instead of pumpkins, people used to carve this instead for Halloween. A, bananas, B, tomatoes, C, potatoes, or D, turnips. How do people not know this? Are they stupid? You don't know. Some people may not know this. I mean, this is interesting stuff regardless. It's D. Yes, D, turnips. Yes, you got it right. Ooh, so cool. Yeah, you got that right. Spirit Halloween Costume Stores opened its first store in this year. A, 1923. B, 2005. C, 1983. Or D, 1996. Yay, Spirit Halloween. The place where all these gross, trashy, normal people can go and fit themselves tightly into these costumes that rip on them. You are like such a stereotype, you know that? Yeah, speak for yourself. Yeah, yeah. The answer is C. Yes, C. 1983 is when Spirit Halloween opened for the first time. The Michael Myers mask from the movie Halloween was inspired from a mask of this well-known character. A. Superman, B. Captain Kirk, C. The Fonz, or D. James Bond? Okay, now this is a good question. Hmm. I'm gonna have to go with C. The Fonz. C. The Fonz, is that your final answer? Were you deaf? No, it's not right. Sorry. <sighs> uh, it was actually Captain Kirk. William Shatner played Captain Kirk, and that was the mask that they used you know and they yeah, messed yeah, with the yeah, eyes yeah. a little bit and yeah so <laughs> it's not like i don't think you do know it all make fun of me thank you candy corn was originally called what a orange melts b honey pieces c chicken feed or d trash oh uh, obviously it's c chicken feed <coughs> chicken feed it is folks Yes, C, chicken feed. All right, so you need to answer one more question right to win this $5 gift card. All right, cool. You have two more questions. Here we go. Lay it on me. It's illegal to sell or use this on Halloween in Hollywood, California. A, common sense. B, silly string. C, fireworks. Or D, alcohol. Uh, probably alcohol, D. Nope, actually alcohol is not correct. Uh, it is B, silly string. Silly string. All right, it all comes down to this. All right, come on. Halloween is how old? A, over 2,000 years. B, 380 years. C, 600 years. Or D, 80 years. We kind of already covered this in a previous question, so if you don't get this right, I don't know what to tell you. You're just dumb. Yeah, stop with the name <laughs> you're calling. Just, you're just dumb, Why man. don't you go get yourself a girlfriend or something? The answer is A. A, over 2,000 years. Yay, you won. Okay. You're the winner. By the skin of your teeth. <laughs> yeah, all right. You won yourself a $5 gift card to Dairy Dip. Yay, cool. And that is it for this very special, spooky, spooktacular edition of Fun Fact Check. Thank you guys for watching. I am your host, Eric Ravenheart. Have a very happy Halloween. Thank you, DJ Glowing Eyes, for putting up this high-end very high budget set for me for this spooktacular you know maybe next year i'll be able to do something that will maybe cost ten dollars instead of five dollars yeah you don't deserve it though you suck <coughs> you're like a loser shut up i don't want to hear it no hey shut up. hey ah, ah. Ah. anyways thank you guys for watching bye bye Hey, pick me up. <laughs> <laughs>